Okay, so let me find the right one. Okay, right, here we go. So good morning. And now we've got the technical bit out of the way. Um, let me say thank you very much, James, for inviting me along and for the very kind introduction, Paula. Um, it's great to be here kind of with you. Um, I'm getting used to this being the way of life after two years. It's gonna be a bit of a shock to actually see a lot of you in person, but it's great seeing you this way. Um, so yeah, I'm Sue, I've been with Juice Plus for absolutely a long time. Um, I also do other bits around the side elsewhere to keep my interest in and keep up with my nutritionist status. So I'm going to talk to you today about our star products. Um, from my slide, you may have a little bit of a guess as to which products I might be about to talk about. Uh, I would like to say though, of course, all our products are stars in their own ways. So I had to choose which ones I was gonna talk about and these are the ones that I have chosen. So let's take a look and see what ones they are. So some of you may recognize this um, as a little inkling into the products that I'm going to talk about. And that dates from probably about 18 years ago um, and I'm sorry, the photography back then wasn't much good either, was it really? Um, for some of you who have been with us a bit less time, maybe these are looking familiar. And I've got the American version here. Um, these came in around, oh, 2008 maybe. Some of you will know that better than me. A lovely fake um, sort of recycled look to the label. It was very in at the time. But you can see the photography has really come on leaps and bounds. And here we have the one that is what we're all familiar with today. So what I hope this shows is, yes, we have gone through iterations of design and even our packaging style, but wow, look, these star products have been with us for a long time. And that really moves me on to what was the first point to why I chose these products. So, they have a really long history. Next year, if I've got my maths right, um, and James will probably correct me, we'll be celebrating 30 years of Juice Plus. And so that means these products and all the ones that came after them, because our Juice Plus history actually started with the fruit and vegetable capsules. And, you know, nowadays they're in more than 25 markets. They started off in the US and then came over here and we've grown and grown. And what I love about them and where they started is that they came from some good science. And to me, that's really important. And that, I believe, is what has contributed to their longevity as well. Our Juice Plus fruit, veg and berry capsules um, stick very closely to what we consider our brand values and our kind of overall ethos. And if you think we're all about inspiring healthy living around the world, these products contribute towards helping us do that. They're not a magic bullet, as one of my favourite sayings. They are there to be an addition to people's lifestyles and diets. So they're there as a choice to help people be the best they can be. So really this kind of long history and the capsules being the foundation of our Juice Plus product offering really gives them that first step on being star products to me. Now, obviously I'm a scientist. So there's quite a lot, as I mentioned, around the fact that they are founded on science, which appeals to me. Apart from the fact that that gives them credibility, it also gives them a kind of identity and a purpose. And if any of you were around as I was uh, back in the sort of late eighties, early nineties, um, I was working, I think for the UK government at the time. And there were loads of um, reports coming out from government bodies, expert groups, the World Health Organization, 
looking at links between diet and various diseases or, or health conditions. Um, in the UK, there was one, I think, in 1990, looking at um, diet and heart health, and another one four years later, looking at diet and cancer. And this was a, a pattern of behaviour, I suppose, that we were seeing in many different countries and at a global level. One of the things that really came out and was really emphasised when we looked at any sort of link between diet and, and health was that the healthier people seemed to have diets that were higher in fruits and vegetables. And this was a key theme that was being seen in multiple countries, looking at multiple health outcomes and multiple scientific um, research papers. And that to me is, is really, really, really key. It's where we sort of got this five a day or at least five a day or six to nine, all those types of recommendations. And those will vary depending on what market you're in. But the, the underlying common fact is that um, dietary recommendations do recommend eating more fruits and veg as part of a healthy diet and lifestyle. And we've seen more recently that recommendation move on to talking about having plants-based diets that widens it out beyond just fruit and veg. But that, those initial um, studies that were coming out and recommendations back in the 80s and 90s was what sort of gave the impetus to the juice plus capsule idea. Um, there were plans, some of you will know, for juicers. Wasn't really going to work, was it? You know, get your juicer out, make a complete load of mess, end up with about five millilitres of some concoction and a whopping great bin full of waste. And most people used a juicer once, put it away, never got it out again. I know juicers have moved on since. Um, and then there was ideas to make these dried powders. And that was a great opportunity. The thing was that they, when they dry down, they can be quite strong tasting and smelling. And if you've ever tried to mix the powders from the capsules with water, you know you get quite a strong smell and it's not always the nicest um, experience. So putting them in capsules was a brilliant idea. And that's kind of harnessing, and this brings me on to my third point down the list, harnessing those now 30 different fruits, veg and berries and being able to combine them with some selected vitamins and other plant substances in a convenient dose form. They're not there, I should say this, they're not there obviously as an alternative to fruit and vegetables. Uh, wouldn't it be awful? I mean, you can just imagine, can't you? Somebody saying, oh, well, if two capsules is one portion, I'll pop 10 and I'm done with my five a day. It wouldn't really be driving the health recommendations of having a plant-based diet with plenty of fruit and veg. But what they are there to do is to be a kind of bridge between what we should be doing and what we sometimes find we are doing in reality. So to me, you know, they've got a scientific ethos behind them, but they've been translated into something that is, is convenient and a sort of a gap filler, helping people to have a bit of confidence that they're doing something to just support their perhaps less than perfect diet. Now, as a company, we're always talking about whole food, plant-based nutrition and the capsules again, see, the star comes out here because we have worked really hard we've had the products for nearly 30 years but we have consistently been looking at ways that we can always keep them really up to date take advantage of new developments new ingredient formats and so we've constantly been looking at ways that we can best stay true to our ethos of whole food plant-based nutrition our capsules um a, a really good example is that not that long ago we had these wonderful plant ingredients in a gelatin capsule. That seems a bit odd, doesn't it? But actually that was because our powders are quite tricky to work with. And so the capsule shell doesn't just hold the powders in a convenient dose form. It actually protects the powders and keeps them in good condition and high quality. And our powders actually have this habit of trying to suck water from anything around them. And so a lot of capsule shells would actually then get brittle and break. 
which would mean that the powders would spill out, which isn't great as a consumer, um, but also the powders could lose quality. So we, we were consistently working to try and find a solution. And of course, now we have uh, vegan capsules. They are derived from a substance called pululan, um, which comes in turn from tapioca starch. So again, we've managed to continuously improve but stay true to our ethos and stay true to what our products are about, which is fruit, veg, berries, and a few other bits in a capsule form. So I'm going to go back to being my nerdy scientist self now. And obviously it's not just that the products were founded on some, a scientific idea, but it's the fact that since being introduced nearly 30 years ago, the company has committed to a huge research program. To date, over 35 pieces of individual research have been carried out on either the fruit and veg capsules or the fruit, veg and berry capsules. That's a huge amount of research. It's resulted in over 40 published papers. The quality of the research is really robust as well. There's a lot of independence around it. The company, yes, does provide funding. That's standard for a branded product. You're not going to get government funding in most cases there, although we have on a couple. But what's also important about it is that the company then makes sure that there's product and placebo available, but has no involvement in the actual running of that study. Those studies have been carried out at leading research centers and institutions around the world by people who are experts in their field of research. Furthermore, the studies have been published in peer reviewed journals. Basically, that's what it's kind of like you handing your homework to somebody to check it before you give it to the final teacher to be put up on the wall. So peer reviewed basically means that your paper, your research has been reviewed by experts in that area of research. And they've said yes or no to whether it's good quality before allowing it for publication. Yeah. So we can have a lot of confidence in the quality of that data. Now, I know there'll be some of you on here who say, but in Europe, we're constrained by regulation. We can't share that research openly. To me, that's not a problem because we don't need to be experts in the science. I may be to a point, but most of us, that's not our day to day job. We just want to share the juice plus story and we can do that by saying that the products are backed by over 35 robust pieces of research that have been resulted in over 40 independent peer reviewed publications. The numbers are what matter. They give credibility to both the products and the, um, the, the brand itself and the company. Now, a final point, and I wouldn't be a very good quality manager if I didn't come on to talking about the high quality of our products, would I? Um, and this is another really important feature to me. We work hard as a team internally. There's three of us covering the whole of global products uh, for Juice Plus. And we do a lot of work with us, our ingredient suppliers, our manufacturers, even down to our warehouses to make sure our products are of the high quality you expect and we demand. Of course, we then allow others to verify that. So we have on the box for the Juice Plus capsules, the Fresenius quality seal, which is basically confirming what we know, that the products are high quality. And they do that through inspections and testings. They even look at the packaging. And then for people who are involved more in sporting activities, we have the informed choice certification. Again, get that certification that the organisation will behind informed choice will go and inspect the manufacturers, make demands of the supply chain and do some product testing. And that results in confidence for people who are involved in um, sporting performance, that the products are safer for them to choose. So that to me, I've whistled through that, but those to me are kind of like the features around the products that make them star. Very quickly in terms of what about for the star product facts for you know, the user, because it's very well talking about the product, but what about the individual that you're talking to? 
Well, the products are built for longevity. They can be used for, through a multitude of ages and life stages um, to support a balanced diet and healthy lifestyle. So really they're there, you know, once the customer is using them, unless they are advised by their healthcare practitioner, there's no real reason why they can't continue to use them. So they've got this longevity of use as well as longevity of existence. Of course, they're easy to use and they can be portable, you know, but they also have been designed to fit with many different dietary choices. And to me, this is kind of indicative of the, the products keeping up with changes over the last 30 years. You know, we've seen a great growth in interest in plant-based diets, as well as more the more specific vegan as well. The products fit with that. And they are gluten-free and dairy-free as well. So they've been designed to still keep up with dietary trends and preferences that we're seeing these days. So to me, you know, from a user point of view, you've, you've got these points that are really relevant to today as, as much as they were sort of 29, 30 years ago. So that's my quick run through of our star product. Um, I hope you share with me this, my opinion that these products are brilliant. Our fruit, veg and berry capsules are there. They've been there for a long time. And I hope that somebody is going to still be talking about them in another 30 years. And I'm also hoping that what I've put up on this final slide about um, being able to help yourself to the product training modules that are on the hub is um, actually now something that you are all able to access because the product training modules have been put together with loads of input from my team. Uh, they're really interactive and you can even test yourself and see how good your knowledge is. So um, that's kind of what I wanted to talk about. Um, Paula, do I hand back to you? Thank you, Sue. Thank you so much. That was absolutely incredible as always. I just love listening to you and uh, I could listen to you for all day. Um, but, you know, thanks for just putting that across in, you know, very short 15 minutes um, of, you know, our amazing products, how special they are and all the, you know, quality behind them, all the research and, you know, and you're doing an absolutely fabulous job of, um, you know, what you do behind the scenes. And, and thank you for sharing that with us this morning. But if you'd, if, if, if you'd like to put in the chat, please guys what you what you what your top takeaway from sue was and give her a really big thank you as well and um yeah thank you so much uh, so now we've got our lovely natasha who's going to share a story with us are you there natasha i'm here can you all hear me yeah excellent thank you <clears throat> Okay, thank you for having me on. Good morning, everybody. So those who don't know me, I'm Natasha. Um, I'm a sports health and beauty therapist um, with over 25 years experience and worked at Champneys Resort and have my own business. I'm also a mother of three boys and our house is never quiet. It's always full of people. I discovered this product through a very caring friend who's also a therapist and, and yoga teacher. And as we've heard from the science from our lovely Sue, um, when I heard the science behind the product, <clears throat> I sat up and I knew that I had to, had to have this for my family first. After doing more research for myself, it was a no brainer personally and professionally. So it's helped me us all in more ways than we can imagine. So my, my clients got quicker and better results from the treatments. It helped me to help them um, from, their, from their skin issues, um, to recovering from, from sports injuries, et cetera. Um, and working the, the hours and looking after the boys, um, it helped, helped me to do less work as well. Um, so working long hours, looking after the boys, I constantly miss meals as well. I got tired and I would fall asleep in the afternoon. So for me, it came right at the right time when I was at my worst. It's also been a lifesaver over the last three years with everything that's been going on um, with the family. So our whole family benefits from Juice Plus. The boys um, train, the older boys train, they go to the gym um, every day. So pre and post sport. Crispin is our middle one. He's got cerebral palsy and he's won the Para National um, Cycling Championships. Um, the boys' eczema when they were young um, is completely gone. My mother-in-law psoriasis 
practically went as well. Uh, their eating habits have, have returned and got much better. They make much healthier choices. They now no longer miss breakfast. And while doing their exams, they ha I had the peace of mind that they had good nutrition um, in their bodies in the form of their complete shakes and the uplift later on doing um, post school exams helped them to have the clarity while training. The, the business, it gave us the financial freedom, um, paid off our mortgages, paid off all our credit cards. Um, I work less physically with my hands now and have more time to, to be here for the children and the family. Um, and it's allowed me also to be there for the children with their sports days, assemblies, et cetera, et cetera. Um, and it has a freedom time away. And we did a tour of Italy, Mexico, and we've got lots more planned. And I just can't express how much we love this product as a whole family and the wider family. Any questions? <laughs> Oh, Natasha, that was amazing. Thank you so much for sharing. I just love that all your family are getting such amazing health benefits. I mean, I've met, met most of them and, uh, and you, you're all absolutely glowing and you look incredible today as well. So thank thanks you. So much that was just Laura. so quick. Yeah, I know. We're all whizzing through. But thank you so much for sharing. So I'm going thank to go you. on to um, Charity now. Charity Ayamu, who's a PMD in the Juice Plus business. She's a mum of two girls and has been in the business for uh, six years. So she says, I was able to quit my job as a customer service manager exactly two years after being involved with the business. Uh, so as I said, she's a PMD currently studying to be a certified health and lifestyle coach. And she's going to share with us today, uh, creating the mindset for success. Are you there, Charity? Yes, I'm here. Hi, Hi Paula. Dave. Good morning. Um, I'm just going to quickly share my screen. I've got a slide I would like to share. Okay. Okay, thank you. All right, so I'm, today I'm gonna to be talking about creating the mindset for success. Um, as Paula introduced, I've just recently qualified for a health and a lifestyle coach. So I'm currently a certified health and lifestyle coach. And all of this is down to what this business has been able to help me to achieve and also having that positive mindset. So for me to start today, um, Winston Churchill said, success is the ability to go from one failure to another without, without no loss, with no loss of enthusiasm. And I wanna start this presentation this morning with this question that you here today as a business owner or an entrepreneur, do you have the success mindset? Do you have that mindset for success? Have you got what it takes for you to be able to achieve success at whatever you do, regardless of whatever the situation at hand might be. Now, let's look at what is mindset. I see mindset as something that I would say it's a deciding factor between an individual success or failure. And if you look at the picture on the left-hand side, you see there's so many things involved in mindset. So it's the invisible X factor. Is something that we see in our lives, in our business, even with our clients, in our day-to-day -day interaction with our clients. We get to see different kinds of mindset. You get to see people with that positive mindset, people who are optimistic, people who are always thinking, getting back to you, I'm going to think about it. It all comes, all comes down to the mindset. So every action we take starts in our mind. Every decision that we make starts from the mind. So making it essential that it is essential that we maintain a mindset that will always propel us in a direction of positive growth and the accomplishment of whatever goals that we have set for ourselves. So now I'm gonna go straight into how do you create that mindset for success? I've put down here four simple steps that I believe would help each and every one of us here today to build or to create the mindset that will set us up for success. Now, the first thing is your input. Check your input. What are you feeding your mind? 
what do you focus your energy on? What do you feed? The same way we feed our body, you know, in order for us to be at that best optimal performance in everything in our physical health and also, we also need to pay that same attention to the information that we consume to maintain good mental health. So we get involved in watching movies, reading books and listening to contents. And sometimes when we do this, we don't really give thoughts to the impact it's having in our lives. And when we don't do that, we discover that we begin to consume information. And it's not just about us consuming those information, but it's about, it's because of that, just that part of life, rather, it's just about this information that you're taking in. Is it the kind of information that I would want to take in? Do we focus, what we focus on, what we focus our energy on or what we focus our thoughts on or our mind on is exactly what we become. They say, as a man thinks in his heart, so he becomes. So what are your thoughts? So we need to get to the point where we are using what we impute to help us to build a successful mindset by intentionally seeking out the good things out of those informations that we are getting, going through positive materials that would actually help us to grow personally and professionally wondering where we start or where to start. So we need to look at good books, look at inspiring podcasts or attend events. We've got an event coming up now. We've got our leadership convention, European leadership convention for the UK brand, for those of us who are here in the UK coming up this month. Are you gonna be there at that event to be able to grab those positive materials, those positive informations that you're going to be hearing. So I would say, get into the habit of asking yourself questions. If I'm reading a book, I'm watching a movie or whatever I'm doing, is it gonna help me to become better? Is it gonna fill me with those positive emotions that I need that will help me to achieve the success I want to have in life? Is it gonna be able to add value to me? If not, then think twice about investing your time there. And then the second one, I would I say, establish healthy habits. Every habit that we form each and every day eventually becomes a lifestyle. So habits are incredible time savers, helping our brains to make decisions easier by, by avoiding conscious deliberation about what we do. Consequently, when we do that, like I said, habits make, make up a larger part of our daily activity. Because if as we continue to do it every single day, if we cultivate the habit of thinking positive, reading positive books, sourcing that information and picking out what is adding value to us, we discover that those things end up to become part of us. It end up to become a lifestyle. And the right ones that we pick will actually help us to fast track ourselves to becoming successful. Now I'm gonna recommend this. This four, I call them the four power practices. Gratitude, always be grateful for where you are and look forward to where you're going by setting goals. And when you set those goals, have positive affirmations. When you have positive affirmations, reflect on them. So we make it her habit to practice this every morning and every night. The mind looks so simple to do looking at them, gratitude, setting goals, positive affirmations and reflections. But I guarantee you that by the time you start getting yourself involved in this, you will discover that there are powerful tools that would help you to create a mindset that produces growth and achievement. And then cultivate your community. It's been said that you are the average of five people closest to you. One of the ways that we can create a success mindset is by intentionally investing our time with people who inspire us to do better. People who can help us to be able to achieve more. People who think differently than we think. And these are people that will be able to encourage us and uplift us. And I wanna ask us this question. The friends you have, do they make you feel encouraged? Do they uplift you when you are around them? What impact, what positive impact, what positive role are they playing in your life? And if they are not, then you need to think twice as regards to investing your time with such people. Are you making connections with new people? 
Are you looking at sourcing out to meet up with new people who can actually help you to become a better version of you? Not only does this add excitement and fun to life, it also helps to broaden our perspectives and stay inspired. Connecting with a community is a crucial component of maintaining the right kind of mindset. So we need to surround ourselves with other like-minded people, high achievers who will be able to support us and propel our ambitions forward. And the last one I'm gonna be looking at is to reevaluate your self-talk. We must admit that every single one of us here, we talk to ourselves when things are not going right, when things are going wrong, when things are going the way we don't expect them to do, we talk to ourselves. And the truth is that the words that we use are very powerful. The words that we speak are very powerful. So in order for us to create or to build a successful mindset, we need to first of all become aware of those internal dialogue that we have within ourselves. What do you say to yourself when you feel pressured? What do you say to yourself when you make mistake? What do you say to yourself when you have that big win or when something, well, when you're trying out something new? For those of us who are new in this business and you're coming, and those of us who have been long in this business, what do we say to ourselves every single day, every single morning when we wake up? Whatever we say to ourselves, we tend to forget one thing. It's easier for you. It's easier for me to turn around to someone and encourage that person. But yet we don't speak the same kind words to ourselves. So catch yourself when you start to think, oh, how could I have messed up again? So stupid. Why don't you just switch that and self-talk yourself to something that is more encouraging? Something like, that's all right. I can do this. I will get it next time. And when we've discovered that we do this, I look at the, the gap here. If you look at the image that we've got there, you discover that the distance between you becoming successful and you becoming a failure is what you're learning, what you learn every single day, what you're teaching yourself from the books that you're learning, from the people that you're meeting, from the engagement that, we, from the engagement that you have every single day is that learning process. And I believe that's what this business has been able to give me, myself. The fact that I have been able to learn, to develop myself, to become a better version of me. If I wasn't in this business, or if I, have, if I haven't met this, the set of people that I have met in this business, I would not have gotten the courage to step up to say, I want to become a health and a lifestyle coach. So I want to end this by saying, remember, the best version of you in both life and work is closer than you think. And with these four steps, if we are able to, if we're able to put it into practice, I guarantee you, I have done it and it's worked for me, that it would actually help you to have that mindset that will get you to wherever you want to get to. Thank you so much. Charity, that was absolutely incredible. Thank you so much. Oh my God, everyone's saying like we needed that this morning. Um, but yeah, I just love that. I mean, it's just so true. I mean, mindset is absolutely everything. I know it's what lets me down in my life, but um, I, I think you're going to be... Um, you know, absolutely incredible with your new, your new uh, coaching business as well. I definitely hire you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank so you. Much. Can everyone put in the um, chat their takeaways from what they um, what what they loved about Charity's presentation just then and what they took away? Thank you so much. Um, and then we're going to go on to we've got we've got a guest now, um, Celest Celestina. Is it who's going to share a story? Are yeah, Celestina, are you here? Yes, I'm. Good morning, everyone. Morning. Are you hearing me? Yeah, we can hear you. Hello, is everybody hearing me? Good morning. We can hear you. Oh, we no. can hear you. Oh, okay. Okay, good morning, everyone. My name is Alastina. Oh, yeah. I can't see everyone. Is anybody hearing me, please? We can see you, all brilliant. Yes. Oh, okay, okay, thank you. Yeah, we can hear you, we can hear okay, you. My... Just go, we can see you. 
Sorry, I can't even say I don't know what that was why I was acting, sorry. Uh, good morning, my name is Alistina, and my story is just a humble one. Uh, I'm an inter online entrepreneur and also a healthcare worker. But when I got to know about this business and the product, it's through a friend that I never met from where, anywhere. He just sent me a message on the Facebook, I accepted and we started talking and I told her that I wanted to lose some weight. And that's how I started. So when she convinced me of buying the product for losing weight, I said, okay, no problem, let me buy the product. But at the long last, she told me, if you want to buy the product, why don't you join the business? You can get your 10% back. I said, really? So you will buy a product and they will still give you 10% back for the product. I said, yes. I said, okay, let me join in and take the 10% back. Who don't want money back? Everybody wants the money back when gets a product. So when I, I got my 10% back, I said, well, this is good. So after two months, I joined the business. I wasn't doing anything. I was just taking my products and watching my weight and doing exactly the way she told me to lose weight. Because I wanted, if I want to tell people about the product, I need to experience it first before I can tell the story about the product. So two months into the business, I got an accident. I broke my right tendons, my right knee tendons. I was on knee breeze. So when I got to the hospital, I'm over 40, and the doctor said that this, your problem, will take months to heal. I was set, I was admitted into the fracture hospital going with uh, physiotherapics. But four weeks into my, into my fractal clinic, I got discharged. I asked the doctor why. He said, you, doesn't, you don't need it any longer. Whatever you are doing, it worked for you. That was when I started asking myself, what was I doing? I asked Coach Charity that look at what happened, that I was told that I'm I don't know what I was doing. He said, that is what the product is doing. That's what the product, especially the Omega, that is what is doing for you, that you've already been discharged. Why are you complaining that you are discharged? I said, but I don't understand. Because when they told me that it's going to be about six months before I can go back with my leg, but within four weeks, I've already taken away the nail brace. I was taking away the crutches. Everything was gone. And even the physiotherapy has also discharged me. I said, wow. So I can have my first hand story to tell people that this product works. That was when I started doing something in the business and I got my promotion. And another of my stories, I introduced also my husband into the product because when I started hearing people's testimonies about diabetes and what it has done for them, I introduced my husband into it because I know he's also a diabetic person. Three months into him using the product, insulin was taken out of him. He is no more doing the insulin. And another thing, he always used metamorphin 1,000 every day, but it was also cut down to 100. That he told him that he doesn't need it up to that again. And just last month, just the last month, my husband was discharged totally from the diabetic hospital, saying that he doesn't need to come to hospital, he doesn't need to take the insulin, and he doesn't need to take the metamorphin. That he is totally free from it. And just like Charity say that when you are doing something, you check your habits. So this product, this platform has taught me that not all the time that you eat, you are eating healthy. That is the way you will eat, you are not eating healthy. Just by the fact you are cooking your food and you are doing everything, that you are not eating healthy. And another thing, I got back my self-confidence because naturally I can never come here and start and start talking because I want, I'm a shy person. I can never do it. Even charity would drag me out and I would tell her, no, don't even call me. But I found out that my one year into this business, I found that I can do this. I cannot can do this. And that is how it all started. So this is my story, humble beginning, and I am still here learning to be there.
Thank you. Celestina, thank you so much for sharing your incredible story. What amazing results you and your husband have had. Um, and I love, well, love your results, but you know, your husband being discharged from his diabetes clinic is absolutely incredible. So, you know, as you, as you just say, just take the products, get the results, and we can just share that and help as many people as we can. Thank you so much for sharing. Um, so everyone give a big thank you to Celestina and we're going to move on to our incredible Jeffrey Montagu Smith. So Jeffrey is a IMD in the business. He's a registered osteopath. I have to read this because this one is a long one. <laughs> He's got a long bit bio. Uh, registered osteopath and the founder of the Atman Clinic in Tunbridge Wells in Kent. He also sees patients from his London clinic in the city. Um, he, pa he practices integrated osteopathic medicine, combining med many different complementary medical methods and naturopathic principles. He teaches um, in internally and often at in oh sorry internationally and often at international conferences it has a special interest in bioenergetic medicine and the body mind spirit connection jeffrey recommends juice plus to all of his patients as one of the foundation foundational pillars of health um, so jeffrey today is going to be talking to us about working the marketing plan and to make money are you there jeff I am Paula, thank you. I will have to shorten that bio, that's far too long and detailed, <laughs> isn't it, don't you think? Um, Celestina just highlighted all the reasons why we're here, why I'm here. You know, those health stories and those testimonials are so powerful. And I'll just say that after 11 years nearly of being associated with this company and recommending this product, we've got countless stories of people turning their lives around and their health around from the amazing product that Sue highlighted and that's why I'm here. But we're also here because it can free us financially if we play the long game. And James, thank you for inviting me uh, to do this. Uh, you've given me the challenge of doing what would normally take an hour in about uh, 10, 15 minutes. So I'm going to do my absolute best for you. And then we're going to hear from one of our partners in our team, Mari, who's a fantastic uh, lady. She's going to speak very briefly when I finish. So I'm going to go as fast as I can. I'm going to share my screen. And we're going to see if we can get through this in one piece. <clears throat> OK, so let me just minimize that. Um, right. Can you all see my screen, first of all? Is that uh, is that showing up? Yep. Right. Good. OK, let's just go from the beginning here and then we can we can crack on now. OK, as we get associated with the company, we become a Juice Plus franchise partner. And we're normally at this point an active user of the products and we're really excited about the benefits of the products and we're going to start to be very happy to share those benefits with others. And for the small registration fee of £50, we are going to get partnered with the company and we're going to be put in a position where we can start to recommend the benefits of the products to end users, to customers who would then um, go to the web portal that the company gives us. We all have a replicated sales and marketing page, which is uniform worldwide, and we can then start to engage the customer and they can deal directly with the company. They make their purchase online, ordering just as you would through any other website, and the company do all the heavy lifting for us. They do the invoicing, they do the collection of the uh, funds that are going to pay for the product, and they then deliver the product direct to the customer's door. So we are not in a sales business, we are in a recommendation business and the customer is dealing directly with the company in whichever region they're living. And for that, we get paid a thank you commission from the company because we found the company, uh, a, a partner, a customer, somebody who's gonna enjoy the products and transform their lives by taking the products. And typically, if you do this correctly and if you educate people correctly, they will use the product on an ongoing basis and you will get paid over and over and over again for finding that customer. And if they're using your link as they refer to their friends, you are going to find that you are going to build a customer base almost by accident. So that's what's involved in being a Juice Plus franchise partner. And the first area where we get rewarded, and there are several areas, and I don't have all the time to go into every area, but the first area we have where we can build an income from building a customer base 
is through what would be described as straightforward retail activity. Um, so as we get into the retailing process, I'm just actually, I've realized I need to start my timer because I do not want to go over time here. Um, we get 10 to 20 percent retail profit. You could describe it as a, a retail sales profit, RSP, on the recommendations that we make. So when someone orders the product from the company, um, we are going to get paid by the company for finding that customer, as I just described. Now, depending on the position that we have with the, with the company, and that is dependent on volume, and you'll need to understand a little bit more about how we grow the business to get to the various steps here. But what I want you to think about, if you're fairly new into the business, are the first four steps. At the very outset, we become a partner. And Celestine there was talking about how she was using the product and then she joined as a franchise partner to get the 10% uh, retail sales profit back on her products. So that was the discount that she got. Now, as a partner or a partner plus or senior partner or sales coordinator, as we go up through the plan, as we find customers and build volume, we attract a higher retail sales profit. Now you can see as a sales coordinator, that you get 20% retail sales profit instead of 10%. So it would make sense if you're gonna engage with the company and build a business with them, that your target should be to get to the position of sales coordinator. And that is a relatively straightforward thing to do if you understand how to build the business using the established franchise plan that the company gives us. And you'll notice that you immediately start to make more money for each sale of each product as you go up the pay plan. Now, if you're a sales coordinator and you find 10 customers that are going to be a, uh, you know, that are going to use the products, just the premium capsules on a regular basis, you can see over the year, because there are three orders of four month supply. So we have a, a you know, over the year, you can make in excess of 1,300 pounds just from finding 10 customers that are going to use our capsules to bridge the gap in their diet. The second area where we can make some money is by team building. So what we can do once we've established and learned how to find customers and educate people about the benefits of the products, we can train others to do the same. Now for doing this, the company will pay you up to 10% to train others. We call that a training allowance. So if you have your own customers and you can find other partners who can agree with you that this all makes sense, you can teach them what to do and they can find their own customers for the product. Now, those partners might decide that they're going to find people that can come into agreement with them. And you can see we start to build a group of people all aligned to the idea of helping others to regain their health and top up their wealth. So that group volume is going to start to grow the more customers everybody finds. So as we go forwards, you know, you're going to have your customers. If you just place a few orders with your own order and, and with customers saying yes to the product, you're going to hit your first promotion once you've done what we call 825 retail volume credit points. And you will now become what's called a partner plus that first step on the ladder. So here we are. This is the first uh, position. It's the building block of our business. We build our business. We just have to get started and start to figure out what to become uh, as a partner, how we do that by finding customers, and then we just teach others to do the same. So really, the, the, it's just about getting started and figuring out how to get the skills to show others what to do. Now, once we've learned what to do, we can show others, and if we teach three others to do the same, and they've got their own customers, we start to grow volume. So that group volume that I showed you earlier will start to build, and you will start to hit the positions on the pay plan, the next step on the ladder. In this case, it's uh, now called senior partner, actually, rather than senior direct distributor. I'll have to change that. But it's senior partner is the, the next step up from partner plus, and this all takes us towards the, uh, the end position, which should be, for most people, uh, the position of sales coordinator, which I showed you earlier. Now, one thing to realize, and this is key, is that you can find um, somebody who loves to sell and will find lots of customers and they're going to get to that position of senior partner, hit the volume, the 2,500 points. They can do that on their own, but only about 10% of people like selling. 
most people would rather see themselves as entrepreneurial. They would like to be uh, building their own business, have the freedom that comes with building their business, be a business person, work closely with others. And that's most people that join our business. They're on a part-time basis. They do not want to be a salesperson. They want to be a team player. And that's what we are looking for. People who can educate others and be a team player. Um, and if you are that, then you can find that, uh, you know, those 90% that feel like they want to be entrepreneurs and drive their own future and have freedom, they can teach others to do what they need to do to build the business. So that's what we're looking for. Now, as you increase your income by team building, we are going to get paid teaching allowances or commissions on the volume that's going through your team. Now, as you move towards the position of sales coordinator, as you hit that key threshold of 5,000 points volume going through the business, you can see here that we've in, introduced three people, we've shown them what to do to ascend in the plan, they've got their people that they're working with, and as a team and as a group, the cumulative volume is what lifts everyone up through the plan. A rising tide lifts all ships, and we will get rewarded by the company for teaching these people to do what we've learned to do. So this is where the commissions come in and the training allowances come in. And it is a deeper training that you would uh, need to have on that. I haven't got time to go into all the details of this now, but effectively we get rewarded by the company every time we teach someone something and every time a sale is made as a result of our instruction. So that's a very, very attractive thing for a lot of people. So as that group volume grows at various different levels, We've got different aspects of the team building going on. All these little groups of people, this person that we've introduced has their own business and they're responsible for helping this little group of people to understand what to do. And we, you know, we are all, this guy here um, is working with this girl here. And you know, we're all basically helping each other. Little micro businesses is all part of the same picture. How are we doing for time? Not too bad, good. Um, Okay, so yeah, we get paid these uh, various training allowances for doing that work, and that really adds very nicely to the retail sales profit that the company will pay us for finding our own customers. Now, the third and for me, the most important part of our marketing plan, and what I will tell you is that the Juice Plus marketing plan rewards people for the long haul. If you're here to make some quick, short-term money, um, you know, that is possible, but you're probably going to end up a little bit disappointed because the real power is uh, the marketing plan is geared up for long term longevity. And we call that the networking bonus. It's an override or you could say a royalty on the user network that you create. And it averages out at around 5% on the volume that we create on that basis. And we're being paid that because we are doing the job of all of the different middlemen that would typically be involved in the sale of a product. From the manufacturer to the customer, there is a series of steps that most products go through. And we avoid all of that because we become the person who's the mouthpiece where we're gonna uh, endorse and recommend the product. Um, we are gonna be uh, the guy that, or the girl that shares the website link and you know we get the, um, uh, the distribution taken care of directly through the web portal, as I explained earlier. There's no need for a delivery to the retail outlet. There are no costs involved there because the product moves directly from the manufacturer, from the warehouse in the relevant country into the hands of the end user. So all of these duplicated costs that are part of the normal supply line are avoided with this method of doing the business. So here you are, the company is dealing directly with the uh, customer, on your recommendation, you're being paid retail commission for that purpose. And if you found 10 customers over time, and if you were making uh, you know, that 10% profit equates to about five pounds per customer on a typical premium capsule order, if you have 10 customers, you're making about 50 pounds a month. Now, do you think you could find three business partners to do the same? If you teach those three people to do exactly what you did, they get the same deal you get. They get that 10 to 20 percent commission. They're making their own recommendations and they can then in turn teach others to do what you've taught them to do. So whether it takes you a year or a month, timing is, uh, you know, totally dependent on you and how much time you want to put into this. 
you can start to grow a business where if you teach three and they teach three, you've now got nine partners in your team and you can see how it grows. So we're in the franchise development business. We're here to build businesses using a franchise model, which is templated globally, same product, same business plan, same uh, system to, to, do the, to do the work. And um, it's, a, it's a beautiful, beautiful personal franchise, which is web-based. So we know no limits to where we can go with this thing. So if you have 40 franchises in your emergent team and they each have 10 customers, that's 400 customers for the company that they would not have had without you. So if you make um, a certain amount of turnover on that, so you've got 400 customers, each spending, let's say 50 pounds a month, look at the turnover through your business. And if you've got a 20,000 pound turnover and they're gonna give you a 5% royalty, you've immediately got your mortgage covered or your car payment covered. Look how beautiful that is. And let's say you wanna work with um, five people because you've, you've done a great job with the three, why don't we add two more and teach five how to do the business? So now look at the number, it's going up. You've got more franchises in your team. If they each have 10 customers, the volume is going up. Now you've got pretty much financial independence coming because for most people, an extra 4,000 pounds a month into the household budget is life changing. So we're just increasing our leverage. We're teaching people to do what we've learned to do. If you teach three, you can build a really nice business. We get paid through five levels with the marketing plan. If you teach five, you can see that there's a huge difference in the number of businesses in your, in your uh, team. And the real difference in this scenario would be just two. You taught two more people how this business works and look what happened, look how it grew, teach the teach. And why not when you've built five and taught five people, why not teach another two and get to seven? And that's the beauty of a scalable marketing plan, which is fair and um, there's equality for everyone because we all get paid through five generations. It matters not when you engage with this process, if you come in after the person that introduced you, you get to build five deep, just like they did. And you know, if you build five wide and it duplicates, you are gonna do much better than the person who comes in here and just builds three wide with that same duplication. You know, If someone builds seven wide, they have a bigger opportunity because they built a bigger business. So income is directly proportional to the work that you put in. So, just to finish now, if we're gonna manage our realistic financial expectations relative to this whole process, the networking bonus will reward you in the long term rather than the short term. So you need to understand the way the marketing plan works. If you have two orders going through your number every single month, if the volume is about 100 pounds a month and you're being paid 5% of that in terms of the royalty, it's five pounds. Now. That's not a lot of money. But if you teach five others to do the same and they each have a hundred pounds worth of business, just like you do, you've now got 500 pounds worth of business going through the businesses that you created with the help of these other people. And there's a total volume of 600 pounds in your business now, and you're gonna make 30 pounds every month. That's getting a little bit more interesting. And as this duplicates, you can see the volume is going up Month by month, the royalty is gonna get more and more and more. And because we get paid through five levels and everybody gets the same deal, when you start to look at the total volume that goes through those generations of business, it becomes frankly um, unbelievable. Um, it is unbelievable, uh, but it's still true. And here we are with a, a very large business over the long term, those of us that have been around for a long, long time have got very solid businesses which reward us whether we work or not. Just to quickly tell you, I've had six months out of the business because I've moved my practice to new premises. We've completely remodeled our house where we live and my business continued to thrive even though I was absent. That is the power of a business where if you step out just for a short while, the rest of the business is still working. So you may not be present actively in your business, but the people that you've taught are still going to be interested 
to develop and grow their businesses. And the company will reward you because you taught them well. So this is what we call passive income. And it's the most interesting and exciting aspect of what this company will offer. So there's my timer. I'm gonna stop that and I'm gonna finish now by just letting you know that if we build a duplicatable business online, if we fill our funnel, if we share the story with people and teach them well, if you teach Bob and Bob teaches Jill and that goes forward, you will not know the people further down in your team. You're gonna be rewarded for that process. So if you have a great product story and a love for the products, and you have an amazing business story and a love for the business and a love of teaching the business to others, you can be free, um, you can build your dreams. I love to ski, uh, I love heli skiing, I love cars. You know, we have an amazing life. Thank you to the Juice Plus company. We are building generational wealth. This was about 10 years ago when we got involved with the company. The kids are bigger now, but we have generational wealth and security which I don't think there's any other company that could have offered us that. So with that, I'm going to stop sharing the screen. I thank you for your time. I hope I've done a good job as an overview of the marketing plan. Please see it for the longer term. Um, that's where the rewards are. And I'm now going to pass over to Mari, who will just share her story very briefly. So thank you all so much. Thank you so much, Jeff. And I have to say, as a being a part of your team, it's a testament to how well you've taught us because as much as we miss you on calls, we know exactly what to do because you, you've done the job when we've when we come in. So um, so thank you really much, very much for that. Yeah, so I'm Mari, I'm originally from Norway. I was supposed to live in the UK for a couple of years and here we are 14 years later. Um, <laughs> and I got introduced to the products when I'd had uh, baby number two um, by my good friend, who's now my upline. Amy, um, I couldn't shift my cold. I was really tired, baby wasn't sleeping, all of these things. And uh, I always trust Amy's recommendations. So she said, why don't you give these products a go? I ordered all the capsules. I ordered the chewies for my daughter who was nearly three at the time. And I wasn't very good at taking them, but for her, I thought, gosh, I spent all this money. She better take them. She was a bit awkward at first. So we chopped them into small pieces and we called them superhero sweets. And lo and behold, she started taking them. And um, it was really interesting with her because I noticed physical changes with her. And if you're a parent of a young child, having them go to the toilet regularly is a really big thing, right? So she's th that started happening. I started noticing that her hair and nails, her nails are really naturally really brittle. They started going, getting stronger. So, um, but I wasn't in a situation, I think, where I thought that I deserved to feel quite well. So I actually stopped my order, but I continued with her. But then I started hearing everyone else's stories as I got to know some of Amy's friends who'd been using the products religiously. And I got proper FOMO. So I thought I need to be a part of this. And I started recommending it to my friends and family. And then Amy said, you might as well become a distributor because um, you're giving me all these customers, but you can have them for yourself. And and I know a lot of people get, get into this business because they want to earn some money on the side. For me, it was a bit different. I, I didn't, and I don't want to sound arrogant, but I didn't feel like I needed that extra money. Um, but what it has brought for me in the long term, we're talking now nearly six years later, is a complete change of life. I've met some amazing people. I have um, grown a community of like-minded people around me. I've changed from being an exhausted secondary school teacher uh, with a bit of too much belly fat to being a very healthy and fit person um, who's now studying culinary medicine um, in order to become a nutrition coach. And that wouldn't have happened if I hadn't been exposed to all these fantastic people, including Jeff, who's so passionate about um, sharing what the products can, can help us do, sharing the research behind it. And really uh, teaching us well to the point where I feel confident now talking to people. Um, I've had lots of wobbles business-wise um, over the years and uh, looking at what other people are doing, thinking I should be, I should be, I should be, but I'm starting to find my own voice. And I think that's really important. If there's, if anyone wants to ask me any advice is to find out what works for you, find your own voice. I don't have a big team or anything, but I love, 
I love recommending these products and helping people feel better. And there's nothing better or more rewarding when you have somebody coming, goodness me, I thank you so much for these. My child is not eating fruit and vegetables, but she takes the chewies. It helps me to lower my shoulders and calm down. And, um, and I've got some really, really good friends out of this. And I've got some, some, some people that I'm working with now in Norway. I haven't met them because of lockdown. And they're coming over to London now to, to meet up. And I know these are going to be friends for life um, because of what this business is. So that's, that's, really, that's really my story in a nutshell. It, it's truly, truly changed my life. Yes, energy-wise and weight-wise and, and illness-wise and all of that. But most of all, community. It's incredible when you find like-minded people because... Sometimes being a parent of young children can be really lonely. And so, yeah, I'm, really, I'm just really grateful for everything besides the money that this business has offered. Great, fantastic. Thank you, Mari, thank you very much. And um, <clears throat> thank you, Jeff, tremendous uh, presentation. And Jeff, you just have such an incredible way of making things so understandable. Uh, they say a great teacher is someone who can make something a little bit complex seem very, very simple. And you just did a superb job there, Jeff, and absolutely smashed it. So thank you so much. Loads of people being on, on the chat saying, please, we want the recording. And um, so just to say, everyone, that if you would like to uh, private message me on uh, Messenger, um, then, uh, um, then I will send the recording to you. So my name is James Sanderson, and uh, I'm going to be a host now for uh, the... Uh, last part of the uh, uh, morning, uh, running up till 12. So um, I'm a presidential marketing director with uh, uh, Juice Plus, very proud to say that I've been in the company for 33 years. Uh, and it has been an extraordinary journey. And I'm very, very excited, still possibly more excited than ever before. So we are on an amazing, extraordinary journey together. And uh, I just love seeing all the people on today. Thank you so much for joining us. Some great, great friends uh, with us today. So thank you, everyone. So here we go. We're now moving on. And uh, we are moving now, everyone. Uh, we are moving to Israel. So are you ready to, for that? Uh, so we're going to welcome a wonderful special guest uh, from Israel, um, who I saw a moment ago. She was in her car. <laughs> I hope, Leela Guy, yeah, I, I, I hope I can see you out, out of your car now. So, and uh, yes. Israel, what part of Israel are you in today? Uh, currently in uh, Netanya, it's, it's like 30 kilometers from Tel Aviv. Most people know Tel Aviv. Near the coast? <laughs> near, uh, excuse me? Near the coast? If, if I have the coast? No, no, yeah. sorry, are you near the sea? EMD. No, no, no. <laughs> sorry, I don't hear. Are you near I don't the know. seaside? Are you near the beach? Oh, sorry, pretty close to the beach, yes. East oh, yeah. Coast, yes, I now understand. Uh -huh. yeah. Great. All right. Well, look, let's just move on. Very I'm into the business mind, not uh, into the coast yeah, mind. <laughs> but we're all thinking we want to go to the beach. So, anyway, there we go. So, um, I'm going to uh, introduce you now. And Lilik is. Uh, uh, from Israel, as we've just established. She's an EMD, um, Executive Marketing Director with uh, Juice Plus, which means that she's very senior and she's very successful. Um, uh, Lilak joined the Juice Plus company six and a half years ago. Um, during the uh, first five years, she worked as an orthopedic technician and as a Pilates instructor while combining working offline at Juice Plus. So that's interesting. Uh, during the last year, online partners started joining her and Lilik is showing us how the combination of both online and offline is the right formula for success and that everything is possible. Well, we are sitting on the edge of our seats. We are so excited to hear this. Now, Lilik is going to be talking about how to develop an effective 90-day plan. Now, this is super important because we find that when you sort of focus over 90 days, you can really achieve stuff. And, you know, a lot of people on the call are going to think, well, how can I really do this? So over to you, Lila. Okay, absolutely. Thank you. I'm honored to be here and share my 90 day effective day plan. I have to share with you that almost seven years in the business, uh, I never had a really 90 day plan because I found out because it's a business, it's a people business. I can write whatever I want on paper, like bring X amount of distributors and have a such and such a sales. But in reality, it's not what I wrote on paper. 
because it depends on people. So to those who don't know me, I'm the offline lady. And since uh, COVID-19, I upgraded myself to Zooms and I started understanding uh, the online system. Thanks to a few great partners, uh, you will hear a uh, sorry Glassman after I finish explaining my uh, 90 day plan. Uh, she, she is my pure online lady. And what I found out that works for me, that I'm right now in the middle of my 90 day plan, which is working. That's why I, I accepted your challenge. Uh, otherwise <laughs> we say I have no uh, 90 day plan. So I'll share with you what's working for me. And I hope uh, it will work for you as well. If you can take a few things that I do and implement it in the field, I'm sure you'll see results. So what I found out uh, that most, most of my team members, it's the 20, 80 rules. 80% 80 of them are like customers that just keep ordering or on a very low scale. And they have lots of excuses. My child is calling me, my boss, I'm distracted, TV. I have no control on these excuses. And I try to find how do I put people to work? No more excuses, I need work. So what we started doing, um, I found that my off online lady, sorry, Glassman, she is mission oriented and she doesn't need anyone else in order to, put, uh, to do the work uh, by a daily basis. So I was looking at her and the past uh, few months, and I saw her climbing from QSSC to SSC. And since it's working for her, I said, if I can take what she's doing and implement it to my, to my partners, it will be great to do a cookie cutter. So what I did is two things. I took my top partners like QN QNMD. I have uh, five of those and I did a plan with them. I, I just map the team who is serious, uh, I send them to the field and I told them, ask people who wants to work. And whoever said, I want to work, we give him more attention. So if you want my attention, you need to raise my hand. So I send them to the field to ask their people, um, what would they like to reach in the next three months? What rank? And then to sit with them, what do they need to do in order to do that? Some, some of my uh, team members only work with customers like they are naturopaths, all kind of a, a profession that deal with people and they don't like to deal with distributors. Well, great. This is the amount of customers you need to have in order to reach the rank. And some people love distributors and they don't like to deal with customers. So we have all kinds of people here and we need to, to find out what the person that joined my team like, what is his strength? And once you know his strength, then you can start working with him. So, uh, so this is the, my first thing I did for the next 90 days. I met the people and all the rest, I said, listen, you can be here. Once you want to work, just raise your hand and you'll get more attention. And then I went to the teamwork and that's the bingo. That's why I'm now climbing again. Uh, what I started doing, which I never thought I will did, I do 10, uh, sessions with my team. I commit to be there 10 times a week, five mornings, Sunday to Thursday. I mean, it, um, in Israel, we work on Sunday. Uh, in Europe, it will be Monday to Saturday. So I do it five times a week, nine to 10 in the morning. I, I, I gather my team, the, those who want to work, and we work together. We give them orders. And I'll, and I'll share you, with you what I'm doing in a minute. And in the evening, we have another five sessions, Sunday to Thursday, uh, eight to nine. So no excuses. If you work in the morning, hey, come in the evening. If you work in the evening, come in the morning, okay? And what I found out that we have about 10 to 16 people in every session, which is great for me because the leaders are coming. And what I found out that great people that are here for months or years, they, they, didn't, do, they didn't find a way to, to just stop the day and, and concentrate and do the, the few um, 
the few minimum things that you need to do in order to keep the business moving. And once we de they decided that they are going to be nine to 10 in the morning with me, suddenly the business kick up. I mean, it's, it's absolutely amazing what it does to, to them. So I will share with you what am I doing because I have a challenge. I am 90% offline people, 10% online. First time we met, I was 99% offline. <laughs> so it's getting better. So I split it to few orders. What I can do together online and offline, I do first. And then I split the, the, what I say. Offline, we'll do that. Online, we'll do that. So five to 10 minutes. When we start, I need to lift their spirit. So what I do is maybe uh, sentences of gratitude or something to, uh, that they will write that will make them um, more uh, powerful. Or what I also do, I, I deliver those sessions once or twice a week. I gather about 13 people that they share the sessions. So I make them leaders, I empower them. I say, now you're going to be in the Zoom, I'm with you, I'm your backup, but you're going to give the orders. It's like a teacher and they grow by that. So five to 10 minutes, I, I tell them, do whatever you want, meditation, uh, sentences of gratitude, whatever you want. Once we finish, we start working. So uh, what, what am I telling them? Okay, first thing, we have those people who finished the first uh, payment last month. So we need to renew those customers. In Israel, it's not automatic. <laughs> Only in Israel. <laughs> so we have to call the customers and tell them we are going to renew their order. Okay, we do it manually. So this is for Israel. Um, whether it's online or offline, they need to do it or send messages. Second, um, we have promotion. So in Israel currently for we have three items, like we have the Omega, we have the capsules and we have the complete. So only for May, for any order you make, you will get an extra complete, a bag of complete. So we need to promote it. So whether it's offline by WhatsApp messages or calling them, or whether it's online where they put it in the media, Facebook, stories, status, Instagram, groups, anywhere they want. So they need to promote it. Also, we have another promotion in Israel. Um, the complete is to encourage customers to purchase. I gave them another suggestion to call the customers who are supposed to renew in June because those customers will not have this uh, option in June. So what we found out, someone is uh, speaking with, thank you. Uh, so what, what we found out those guys who need to renew in June are renewing in May because they're getting another complete a bag. It's a gift. Um, so this is a, in regard to that. We have another promotion to encourage distributor to join us. So we need to promote this uh, promotion as well. Again, whether it's offline or online, they know what to do. Third one, we have a convention in Israel in June. We do it uh, twice a year. So it's coming uh, on uh, June 14th. So we need also to promote it. The convention is for us, the distributors, and also to have uh, people who are interested in the business. So they need to promote it, whether it's online or offline. Now, every time we give um, a, a, an order to do something, we give them five minutes to 10 minutes. So we are all quiet and we are working. So we see each other and we work together. Once the time is off, I say, okay, five minutes are done. Let's do the next thing. And if they didn't finish, that's okay. They can continue after we finish. Or okay, they can come uh, at night and continue. Um, also what we do in my team, we promote webinars, professional webinars. I have, uh, biologists, naturopaths, all kinds of uh, pro uh, professional people who do webinars. So we need to promote them. 
because in, in the webinar, you hear the knowledge. We also um, give answers to questions that are being written in the chat. And at the end of the webinar, we ask whoever wants to purchase to go back to the guy who gave him the link and purchase from him and get the service. So this is one of my system, whether it's online or offline, they all enjoy it, the knowledge and uh, this kind of system. So we have a few minutes to promote this webinar as well, the next webinar. Uh, also, we give um, uh, five minutes for follow-up. Some people have been also in communication with us. They needed information. This is the time to close the deal. So we have a few minutes to do the follow-up, whether offline or online. And then uh, I split the, the directions. Offline, what I ask them is to find 10 new people that they never approached. And most of us have those people in the, on our phone. I found out that although I have team members years with me, still the people who are, all, are the, in the, on their phone, they don't know they're in Juice Plus. And here and there, they find a family member or a close friend purchasing it from someone else. Every month, I have at least one person like that. So now I tell them, open the phone, find 10 new people, those who, you, whom you're going to invite to your wedding, uh, if someone happened, those people who will come, they need to know you're in Juice Plus. So I, 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 I asked them to find 10 new people and to write by their name. One reason they have to purchase the, the products and to put um, two uh, positive character traits or personality traits that will help us when we approach them for the business. Like uh, they are verbal, they are entrepreneurs, charismatic. So and we need at least two traits. So when we speak to the person, we can take those traits and uh, share it in the conversation. Uh, the guys who work online, I asked them to find uh, 10 new people they didn't approach until now, find it in the Facebook, they can uh, find a naturopath or maybe someone that they share common things and do like write something. You need to, to start a um, relationship online. It's, it's lower than offline. So they need to find those people. Also, the guys who do online, they need always to renew their friends in Facebook. I tell them, if, those, if the same people are staying, you're going to have a plateau. You need to renew those people. Um, Sari Glassman, uh, she's not uh, just erasing randomly what she's doing. Uh, once you're uh, saying the happy birthday to the guy, we also give uh, five minutes to say happy birthday to whoever have a happy birthday. So if she notice, notices that there is no communication with this person for a long time, so she's erasing him and then find a new person to add to the Facebook. This is another way to look at it. But you need to renew the people. The algorithm of Facebook today is horrible. You have less and less exposure. Um, so Facebook friends. Uh, also in the Instagram, you need to, to start communicating on Instagram to respond to people. Once you respond, you start communicating. Once you start communication, then you can move it forward to have this person as a customer or, or as a partner. Uh, that's in general what I do and what it did to me, I can tell you that I'm climbing like I haven't climbed for a long time. The response is amazing. Uh, I have people that I didn't even think they will ever start moving in the business and suddenly they become leaders in the last months. It's, it's absolutely amazing. People that are, you're, you're going to hear about them in the next month, in the next year, um, because they're doing an amazing job. 
Uh, that's what I wanted to share. And I would love to have a Sari open her microphone and share with us her experience. Hi, I'm here. Hi, I will translate you. It took me a long time, few months, three months to, to convince Sari to come here. Uh, she, she was uh, shy last month when she, went, when she was a QSCC. So now you're an SSC <laughs> and your first, um, your first experience online. אוקיי, אני טרנסלטינג יו. אז שלום לכולם, תודה שהזמנתם אותנו. אני בעצם זכיינית כבר קרוב לשש שנים, אבל ארבע שנים עשיתי את זה רק בשביל להוזיל עלויות למשפחה שלי, ושנתיים אני פעילה. but just to lower the cost. So for four years, she haven't done anything but uh, consuming it. And for the past two years, she just started uh, working in the business online. She started working in the business once she understood she, it can be done online. יש לי שני ילדים, הבן הקטן שלי סובל משיתוק מוחין. אוקיי, היא יש לה שתי ילדים, והילדים הקטנים שלה, היא לא ילדים כבר, היא 20 שנה גדולה, היא סופרת מ-CP, סרפל פרלסי. הוא מסוכן לעצמו והוא צריך השגחה כל הזמן, ואני מטפלת בו בבית. היא יש לה שקרה לעצמו. and he needs to be, uh, he needs to have someone 24-7 beside him. And Sari decided uh, to take this job. She's with him at home, 24-7 with him, taking care of him. אז ברגע שגיליתי שאפשר לעשות את זה אונליין, זה היה כמו לגלות אוצר. Once she understood it can be done online, it was like a treasure for her. כל דקה שיש לי פנויה במהלך היום מוקדשת בעצם לעסק. Every single moment she has during the day, she's dedicating to the business. Uh, הקפסולות שינו את הבריאות של כל המשפחה שלי, ואצל הבן שלי זה היה מאוד מאוד משמעותי. The capsules change uh, the whole health aspect of her family member, and especially her son with uh, the CP. הוא היה אסמטי, הוא כבר שש שנים בלי התקף אסתמה ושלוש שנים בלי דלקת ריאות. זה שינה לו את החיים לגמרי. וואו. הוא היה אסמה, והוא גם היה לנג דסיס, והוא לא סופר מזה עוד פעם. זה פשוט מדהים. אוקיי. אז בעצם מה שאני עושה זה עובדת עם סיסטם אונליין שדייקתי אותו לאורך הזמן. ו... ואני פשוט מקפידה לעשות את אותם דברים כל יום, בכל זמן פנוי שיש לי, בסך הכל זה סביב שעתיים ביום. אוקיי, אז מה שסארי מדברת, היא עושה את זה פשוט אונליין, והיא עושה את זה יותר ויותר אקטורי בזמן, ומה שהיא מצאה, שברגע שהיא עושה את זה עוד פעם ועוד פעם ועוד פעם ועוד פעם ועוד פעם ועוד פעם ועוד פעם, It's working for her. Um, ב- בחודש האחרון, אני, אני צופה המון בסשנים שלכם, ואני שואבת מהם המון השראה, ו- ובאחד הסשנים האחרונים סנטה דיברה. What she is saying that uh, she is joining us is uh, the coffee training sessions, and uh, she got an inspiration from Santa, which was uh, in the uh, last month. He said about the journey of 90 days that she did every day to do live. Oh, Santa shared that she's doing a 90-day uh, challenge to do every day a live. And Sari just loved this idea. And that's what she did since then, in the past month. Okay. As every day I do live, also on Facebook and also on Instagram, or on the app. או על המוצרים. 
So what Sari is doing every single day, she's doing a live in the Facebook and a live in the Instagram, whether it's on the products or the business. I'm going to add it to my uh, instructions, Sari. <laughs> live, I'm writing it. Okay. <laughs> ו- ויכול להיות שזה מה שעשה את השינוי, שהקפיץ אותי מ-QSC ל-SC. And she's saying, that she, if she is, needs to point the finger what made this change, is this lie. It made her jump from QSC to SC in the last uh, month. וזהו, זה, זה בעצם הסיפור שלי, אני ממשיכה לעשות אותו uh, עד ל-PMD. <laughs> זה מתאים לי בול החיים שלי, אני יכולה גם לעזור למשפחה שלי ו- וגם לטפל בבן שלי בעצמי. אוקיי. Okay. So she's saying she's going to do the same thing all over again until she's reaching PMD, not PMD, PMD plus, sorry. <laughs> PMD plus, and it changed her life. I, sorry, uh, do you mind saying, uh, sharing what profession you are, because your, sto- your story is very strong. Um, עד שאילאי נולד, אז הייתי מדריכה של uh, מורים למתמטיקה, בדיוק הייתי בסוף של תואר שני בהוראת מתמטיקה, ועזבתי הכל בשביל לטפל בו בבית. אוקיי, סארי היא שיירינג שאת, אנטיל הר סאן הייתה בורן 20 שנה ago, היא תיצת מתמטיק תיצרס, אני אומרת, She teaches, teached uh, mathematical teachers how to teach. And she almost finished her second degree in mathematics. And then uh, because of her son, she decided to quit everything at once and dedicate her life to her son. And that's why she couldn't afford herself to work anywhere else. I mean, her hands were tight. And once she saw that she understood there is an online system, it just opened her world. And suddenly she could work, she can earn money. and she can do it her time. I mean, she can post any time of the day and taking care of her son, once she has a moment here, two, two minutes there, she's going uh, to post whatever she needs to. Wow, you're amazing. And of course, I have a team that works both in the US and in the US, and this is a joint effort, in the end of the day, together with the change, I have brought me more to work better. Yeah, and Sari is sharing that she has team members in Israel and also abroad, like in the States. And working together, that's what basically brought her to become an, an SSC. And you're one of the most inspirational story. I think you're the proof, the living proof. Anyone can do anything because you, you made it. And many it's lachti kulam yacholim. And that's what Sari said. If she, if she dis, uh, succeeded, anyone can succeed. Brilliant. Thank you, everyone. Thank you, Sari. And thank you, Leela. That was absolutely fantastic. I mean, I've taken so many notes, uh, uh, Leela. And what an interesting approach that you've got. And fantastic that it's working so well. Really. Thank you. I will share with you the results after the 90 days are over. <laughs> and thank you. And, and make sure, please thank Sari so much. That was an absolutely incredible story. Good. Now, everyone, we're moving on to something um, very, very exciting. My great friend, uh, Gordon Wilkie, um, Presidential Marketing Director with our company, is our next speaker. And he's going to be talking about why I'm so passionate um, about the Juice Plus company. And Gordon is incredibly well um, qualified really to talk about this, because as I said, he's been involved for... Um, 30 years. Uh, so Gordon's background is in accountant. Um, he's got uh, four sons um, and uh, he has been very successful with our business. Gordon is like a ball of energy. <laughs> um, he's also a tremendous strategist, really understands the marketing plan so well. Um, he has got background as an accountant. Um, so he's, he's got very, very interesting angle on everything to do with uh, the Juice Plus company. He always knows everything that's going on in, the, in his team, what should be happening and all that. Um, so Gordon and his wife, Michelle, also are living the dream life. So, uh, you know, this morning's theme is all about creating your dream life. Well, Gordon and his dear, wonderful wife, Michelle, are living it 
in Portugal. And uh, um, last month, um, I had the opportunity to, to visit them at their house. And I've seen pictures of it online, as you probably have, but I've got to say, I was absolutely blown away. The view from where they live is absolutely epic. So we might see a little bit um, of that um, in a moment, but uh, I'm gonna hand over to Gordon and he's gonna talk about why I'm so passionate about uh, the Juice Plus company. Thank you, James, and uh, welcome everybody. And thank you very much for having me on. Um, I tried to brighten it up, but this is, this is um, our local beach from where we are. So this is, this is my view, uh, our walking view every, every uh, time we go along the beach and uh, walk over the cliffs. So yeah, we're very happy to be here. I'm happy to be here now and uh, to share my story with you um, very quickly, because uh, I see we're running behind time. But um, my story personally started on the 19th of September, 1991. I joined the business. Um, a friend of mine invited me along to a meeting, went along. I was open-minded. Um, I was at a crossroads probably in my career, really, more than anything else. And there was something he said that, that uh, Twig, I heard from a, a live meeting. I know we we're on the Zoom live, but this was fit person to person live meeting. I, um, I heard some fantastic testimonials as we have done today. And it was an inspiration for me. And I thought, wait a minute, these people can do it, I can do it. And that's what got me started. And, and really, I, I just, I, I taxed it would be the word. I, I went out and with great passion. And my talk is why, why I'm still passionate about Juice Plus. It's not what you say, it's how you feel about what you say. And, you know, listening to Sue talking about her products and, and it's almost like, you know, that's her baby. She's very passionate about it. Um, Jeff Montague Smith talking about the marketing plan, you know, it's, it's, it's his passion as well. Charity, you know, listening to her coaching call, wow, that was amazing. And, and Lily, you know, just just now, how she turned the business down from an online business to, uh, from, from what was a person-to-person -person business. So they're all passionate about their business. I'm passionate about what I'm, I'm going to tell you. And, and there's really kind of key four things that I would say that uh, make me passionate. And, and one has to be the product. You know, we're all charged with the responsibility of building a user base. And, and really, it, the, the core is, is the Juice Plus product. And, and Sue told us all about that. I'm not even going to go into it. But, you know, in my lifetime, I'm sure fruits and vegetables are not going to go out of, uh, out of uh, fashion. Um, you know, if anything, we're eating more of them. Uh, and, and as we become more aware in terms of our health, then we add in all sorts of other things, the berries and, and whatever else. And someone once said to me, if you can find something that the whole world needs, and everybody wants, market it in improved form, you have a recipe for success. And quite frankly, that's what we've got with Juice Plus. You know, we have an amazing recipe for success. Um, and, you know, it's the next best thing to fruits and vegetables. We hear that nobody eats fruits and vegetables these days, but this is the next best thing. And it fills in those gaps between what we should be eating and what we are eating. So that's the first thing. Um, the second thing I would say is the company. I mean, I've, I've, I've worked alongside now the company for 31 years and, you know, they are a phenomenal success story. Um, you know, when I joined, they were, they were really only 20 years in, in the making and, um, you know, they've gone from strength to strength. It, it, it's phenomenal in terms of what they've done and how they've developed it under the auspices initially of um, the, their CEO and founder, Jay Martin. And, and he's been inspirational to so many people around the world. And you know, even now, their mission statement to inspire healthy living around the world. I mean, you know, what, what, what gets you out of bed and what actually gets you motivated to do this business? And if you need motivation in terms of inspiring people to be healthy, and guess what? The first thing you've got to do is to be healthy yourself. And that is very important. And, uh, you know, we become products of the product. We, we actually share our, our business and, and product story. And, um, you know, it's the people within the company that, um, that really help us and inspire us to do that. And they, they're, they're actually helping us on a daily basis to build our business. Um, I mean, I was listening to Lila and I, I almost kind of bit my lips when she told me that she has to phone up every month to phone up to actually all the renewals. 
thankfully we don't have to do that in in most of the countries if not all the countries that that's one a new one on me but we that's what the company's job is so they manufacture the product they ship the product they collect the money from the customer and they account to us at the end of the day as jeff said i mean what what better way to actually build a business than to have that uh, in your offices um really and and you know what they've done in the last you know kind of uh, what 30 years, they, they've, they're now in 28 different countries worldwide. Recently, they've gone into Mexico, Czech Republic, Romania, and Portugal. So, uh, you know, that's very exciting. And, you know, it's, it's the third point that really does kind of capture home, because what the company has done is, is actually built a marketing plan that has seen the test of time. And, and it's a remuneration. Jeff went through it fantastically. And, and really, they, they brought together three fantastic, uh, if you like, business models. One is the franchising. We've got a brand name product. And if you've got a brand name product, you actually can franchise that all over the world, as we've seen with McDonald's, Kentucky Fried Chicken, et cetera, et cetera. Juice Plus is a brand name product, and it is going to be franchised virtually all over the world by us. And um, they've actually taken the, the direct sales element, which is really we're a C2C business, a consumer to customer business. As I said, we're all charged with the responsibility of building the customer base. No one makes money unless we actually have customers that are actually buying the product. And that C2C is very important. And how do we do it? We share our story. And, you know, listening to some of these stories, you know, it's so inspiring. And that's, uh, that's what we do. And finally, network marketing. Network marketing, which is a home-based business, fits into what's actually happened in the world in the last two years. You know, what, one of the challenges we used to have was nobody was at home to speak to. Well, everybody's at home now. You know, we've got an amazing opportunity. And, you know, being able to wrap the business around your, your work, your family, your, your, your social life is so important. And how do you do that? Well, you just share your lifestyle and, um, you know, send that out on a regular basis. The interesting thing about the marketing plan is you get paid for what you're worth. Interesting, paid for what you're worth. So, you know, if you are actually putting it all out there, you're actually kind of going, you know, hell to leather and, and, and you're making, you know, kind of um, loads of people coming into your business. Don't compare yourself with the person that only wants to make a few hundred pounds a month that is actually doing it, you know, very gradually and all the rest of it. And that's so important. You're paid for what you're worth, but that's why you have to set goals and really move forward from there. Um, so the, that then really leads, leads me on to the, 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 the last item, which is really people. You know, if you want to build a business, you need to have people. And you need to, um, as, as the expression goes, if the teamwork is going to work, if the, if the dream is going to work, you need the teamwork to work as well. And, and listening to you know, some of the people that have been speaking today, especially Liliac, I mean, she turned her, her offline business to an online business. You know, that's an amazing transformation to be able to do that. That was a perfect time to do it. And what she's doing is she's teaching people to be leaders within her business. She's moving her whole team forward. And, and that's the greatest thing. You know, the only way that we can be successful is by helping other people get to our position in the marketing plan. And, um, you know, that's exciting. And the excitement comes from seeing their success. And I'm sure James will bear this out. You know, the, what we get most excited about is when someone actually does get to that new position, does get those customers, does move forward. Um, and that's, that's really where we are in terms of that. Um, someone also said to me that, you know, if you can find something that you do for a living um, and love it, it's, um, it, it becomes a labor of love. And the definition of a labor of love is a task for pleasure, not for reward. That's interesting as well, isn't it? So really, and, and, and finally, just in, in finishing up, um, you know, I think if I look back in my 31 years within the business, it's been an amazing, fun journey. Um, we've, we've had great fun times and, you know, we, we play hard, but we, we also work hard to actually do, be able to do that. You know, I've traveled, traveled across Europe, traveled across America with the business, massive recognition. You know, corporate life never gives you too much recognition. You know, my old boss used to say, just tell people enough to keep them in that position. And, uh, you know, in case they overtake you, 
I'm going, whoa, wait a minute, our business, you've got to tell them everything so they do overtake you. And that's what you want. As Jeff said, he hasn't worked for six months. I've probably had four years where we haven't really put the same effort into our business and I'm still getting paid by the company and Michelle is as well. So, you know, we're happy about that. Um, you know, the other thing is, if you want to step into the program, the rewards and incentives that are actually available is amazing. And it shows you that the business works and that's what's really good. And we've got more products coming down the line. You know, we've just, we've launched Perform this year, um, which is, you know, a, a protein based drink, which you know, professional athletes can have, or, you know, just the, uh, the weekend warriors. And it's another product that we can approach people with. The other one, which I'm excited about, is Tower Garden, and that's coming down the line, I'm sure, very soon. And that's where we are actually able to grow in a hydroponic gardening system um, from seeds, uh, our own produce. And really, in the world today, what better way of actually kind of becoming self-sufficient? You know, we're all now looking for ways of increasing um, our, our, our zero carbon footprint, um, you know, looking after in terms of like gas and oil and all the rest of it. Well, same with food sources. We can actually build our own food sources, and that's what Tara does. So that's really me. I'm, I'm 31 years in business, still passionate, and uh, I'll, I'll hand you back to James, and I think we've got Howard. If he unmutes himself, mutes himself, he's just going to give you a quick uh, two-minute Howard testimonial about uh, the business. Thank you very much. Well yeah, done. thank you, Gordon, and, and, uh, and wonderful to hear your story. I just worked out that uh, five months and 12 days after you joined, uh, I actually joined in my first incarnation with NSA and latterly Juice Plus. Um, what I did around about two I years into my... Interrupt, Jared, Howard. I meant to say, under people, oh. the most important person in my life is my wife, and I met her at a Juice Plus conference in Wiesbaden in Germany. So be very careful what you put your plan to, because sometimes uh, it does come uh, to, to true life. And, you know, I'm so grateful with, uh, with having, you know, Michelle by my side. And, and she was really the instrumental person in coming down to Portugal. So there we go. Sorry, Howard, carry on. Howard, where have you gone? Sorry about that. Yeah, so as I say, uh, just over five months after you joined, Gordon, I actually joined in my first incarnation with the, with the uh, Juice Plus company, previously NSA. And um, I was in the corporate world back then. And about two years in, the corporate world came calling with a seductive offer that I took up. And I chose to take the next 20 years away from the Juice Plus business. That's something I wouldn't recommend that, that, is, that is repeatable. And don't do that. However, my original sponsor late in 2013 uh, came back to me and his timing was very opportune for two reasons. He didn't realize this. Firstly, I was doing a lot of road cycling back then. Not, not, nothing competitive, but I was I was doing events and I just committed to a major Alpine event the following summer. And I knew that the quality of the Juice Plus uh, products would underpin the training I was going to have to do. At that stage, I had my own business. I come out of the corporate world. I had my own business and I was, was suffering dis, uh, difficulties following the financial crisis of 2008. The shockwaves were starting to hit me and I needed a plan B. And one thing he told me was that the Juice Plus business is a very different business now. Well, he was certainly, he was certainly right there. It took me a little while to actually do the due diligence to actually come on board. And it, almost exactly eight years ago, I chose to do that. Now, it was very fortunate that I had you know, great mentors, great teachers, have the infrastructure now to be able to join calls like this and learn from people, not only seasoned hands like Gordon and James, but newer people who have the online world absolutely at their fingertips and they know it so well. And these are things that I am able to actually uh, learn and teach to other people. My undying belief of the product is, uh, is such that um, I will never, ever stop taking it. My other half, she used to have uh, Paula, who some of you may well know. She used to have IBS quite badly. I can't make a medical claim. I can only relay my own experience. And her experience was that it cleared up within two to three months and eight years later, it's never returned. But the best thing is, is we've only just started. And that is why I'm so passionate about this business, is that we have so much to look forward to. Markets where people have exactly the same concerns. They are struggling with their health. They are looking for ways to actually improve their health and improve their lot. And financially, with all the, all the problems and challenges and, uh, and upheaval that COVID has created, 
it offers them that solution as well. And with the way that we're able to connect to other people all over the world, it has never been easier to actually get forth our message, you know, to take our story globally. And we have only just started. These markets will open up in the fullness of time. And as Jeff said, you've got to be in for the long game to experience that financial security, that financial freedom. And for me, in my late 50s, I don't have any other way, any other place to go. I found something that I can stick with forever. And that's what I'm intending to do. Thank you very much. Great, Howard. Really, really wonderful. And Gordon, thank you so much uh, for your presentation. I mean, you are living, you and Michelle are really are living the life. I mean, um, you know, today is called creating your dream life. And, and, uh, and that's what Gordon and Michelle are doing. I mean, to Michelle's great credit, she had the vision to go out to Portugal and you are living in such a beautiful place. Um, and it just shows what's possible with our business. Um, you know, and that anyone really can live their, their dream life. So fantastic. Thank you so much, Howard, as well. And now we're moving on to our final speaker, um, the incredible Damon Brennan. And Damon um, is going to be speaking uh, to us about what it takes uh, to be successful in network marketing. So that is our business. And some people are going to say, oh, how am I going to achieve this? How am I going to be able to live my dream life? Now, I hope you've already picked up some great information so far about the product and how it awesome our company is and how really that you would feel confident about knowing that this is really a legitimate business that can really bring home the goods for you over many many years and that's exactly my experience my experience this absolutely works a hundred percent but you've got to find the way to sort of you know in a sense open the safe you've got to find the combination and um but once you do honestly things will just be epic so I'm going to introduce you now to Damien. So uh, Damien um, lives in the west of Ireland. I don't know how many people have been to Ireland, but Ireland is such a beautiful place. I love the fact all the Irish always talk to you. You know, it's such a chatty place. Um, he's a retired schoolmaster. He and his wife, Olive, run a very successful Juice Plus business. They are involved in farming also. Um, so I just bring someone else in and uh, yeah. And um, <clears throat> Damon and Olive were introduced to Juice Plus in 1994, can you believe, just over 27 years ago. Uh, at that time, as well as a headmaster in farming, they owned an, uh, and operated um, a manufacturing business, imagine it, and were very involved in local community activities, and they had a young family. In reality, they did not have time to get involved in the Juice Plus business, but it seemed too good of an opportunity to pass up. They loved the Juice Plus product and were attracted by the challenge of building a business. Back in 1994, building a business was much more difficult than it is today with no social media, very basic phone service, no home delivery of product and no bonuses. But Damon and Olive <coughs> were committed and they built a solid business to NMD level and then to PMD. Damon says the business gets easier every year. The highest earners in the Juice Plus business have not yet been sponsored and the best is very definitely yet to come. So ladies and gentlemen, let me introduce you to the very, very extraordinary and wonderful Damien Brennan. Damien, are you there? Great. Damien, we can't hear you. Can you hear me now, James? Perfect. Yeah. It's just all this modern technology it gets to me after a while. Oh, wonderful. We're, we're ready to go. Okay. Uh, I have to say, first of all, it's been a fantastic morning, but I, I, I have to sympathize with Gordon. I couldn't imagine leaving Ireland and having to go to live in Portugal. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> oh, terrible, terrible. Anyway, I know we're against the clock, as they say, so I will move on quickly. Network marketing, a world of opportunity with Choose Plus. So, when we talk about network marketing, what exactly is it? Well, network marketing has been in existence for more than 70 years. It's an innovative distribution model, which many companies use instead of traditional distribution. They set up a network of partners who take a good product, which they are using themselves, and they recommend it to prospective customers. 
It's word of mouth advertising where the partner shares a product with a prospective customer whom he or she has already built a relationship with. And that's really important that uh, we first of all build relationships and then after that we um, after that we uh, uh, introduce Juice Plus. In this system, everybody wins. For the customer, product is recommended by a person they know who is using it themselves and who cares. And second advantage for the customers is it costs less to buy from the manufacturer, to buy directly. For the partners, we get commission for recommending products that we believe in, and we would recommend them anyway, even if we didn't get paid. And for the company, they don't have to get involved in all the expense of advertising and merchandising and so on. Secondly, their products are recommended by a friend to friends, so it's a really strong recommendation. And as well as that, they have free customer care for each of their customers. So for the company, it's a great uh, deal and also for partners and for customers. Currently, network marketing accounts for almost 200 billion pounds in annual sales worldwide. And partners or distributors who distribute these products earn up to 80 billion a year. The success of network marketing is based on the fact that the product is being recommended to the customer by someone they know who is using it themselves. Secondly, the quality of the products. There have to be really good quality. And thirdly, the follow-up customer care provided by the partner. So how do you earn income? Income is by way of retail profit, commissions, bonuses, and incentives. You do not get paid for sponsoring a partner. Income is based on the sale of a product to a customer. So nobody gets paid until a product is sold to a customer. When you recommend a product to a customer, you get paid a generous commission, and you can also set up a network of partners to do the same. And you get a small commission on the total sales of that network uh, in recognition of the fact that you are training uh, the network and that you are helping those people to be successful. Partners sometimes exaggerate how easy it is to build a network and to earn substantial income. It's certainly a great business model with enormous potential and great advantages, a business which anybody can succeed at, but it takes commitment and consistent work to earn really big incomes. Initially, you have to work more for less, but as your network grows, you work less for more. The products have to be of the highest quality or otherwise they won't sell. And there certainly won't be repeat business. So we can be assured that the products that we distribute under this system are of the highest quality. Partners have to resist the temptation to exaggerate the power of the product, however, because sometimes partners are too excited and too eager and they tend to exaggerate. There is no need to exaggerate. In fact, it's much better to under promise and over deliver. Finding the right network marketing business then. What are we looking for? These are the fundamentals. First of all, the company. It needs to be a company that's well established and stable with a proven record, an experienced management team, and a company that provides strong support to the partners in the field. In relation to products, Ideally, it's a product that you can identify with, that has an extensive market. If it's consumable, that's brilliant because you've got repeat business and a product that will be in demand into the future. The, a business system then that's simple but effective, easy to learn and easy to teach with minimal risk. And we've, we've heard all of this from all of our speakers earlier today. We're looking for a marketing plan that's simple, but that pays you well. So these are four of the fundamentals of uh, a marketing, a network marketing business that um, will give you success. The Juice Plus network marketing business opportunity rates extremely well under all of these headings. First of all, in relation to the company, we've got a solid, stable company with more than 50 years of experience. That is pretty unique. And they provide unrivaled support to us in the field. 
in relation to products. Again, we have exceptional products, and Sue outlined all of that this morning. Plant-based whole food products. With the, for those products, there is literally an unlimited market. Almost everybody can uh, consume and benefit from Juice Plus. We have a simple and powerful franchise system, which is easy to learn and easy to teach. And we've got seven sources of income. First of all, the company. They started off in 1970, started by Jane Martin, small direct sales company. And they've grown to be a very successful global company, operating in more than 25 countries 52 years later. The company has doubled in size since 2013 and is continually expanding. Approximately 200,000 independent partners. And at the moment, they're engaged in a program of global expansion. The products, whole food, plant-based nutrition, a simple solution to a common problem. They're convenient, effective, and affordable. Consumable with automatic reorder system. And the market for those products is almost 100% of the population, young, old, male, and female, with monthly repeat business on automatic reorder. We have a simple franchise system. You simply take Juice Plus, experience the benefits, and share that experience with other people. Really, we solve problems. We start a conversation, listen, identify a problem, empathize with that problem, and offer a solution. It couldn't be simpler. So at the beginning of each month, the goal is how many people can I help this month? Because that's our mission. We're there to help people with these fantastic products. It's the ideal home-based business. There's no investment. 50 pounds, 60 euro. We don't need a premises. Amazing. No conventional overheads of regular business. No stock to purchase. No deliveries. No cash to collect. No employees. No wages to pay. Flexible working hours. You're your own boss. And absolutely enormous potential. I don't think we really appreciate the potential of this business. What else could you look for in a home-based business? It's just unbelievable. For Oliver and myself, we came into this business owning a manufacturing business. Just imagine the difference. We had remortgaged our house to build a factory and all of these other expenses followed after that. We're really highly paid storytellers. Develop a great product story based on your conviction about the product. Develop a great business story based on your conviction about the business. Conviction comes from understanding, of course, from appreciating, and most importantly, from experiencing. When, for instance, in relation to the business, when you are a new distributor, get a check. It's a great way of building your conviction about the business. Experience is a great teacher. Sources of income. And again, Jeff covered this earlier on. We have retail profit, we have commissions, we have performance bonus, promote out bonus, business incentive bonus, fast track bonus program of 119,400. And we have special promotions on top of all of that, money maker spring, money back May, and so on. We get highly rewarded for the work we do. And based on that, you can make a good part-time income or indeed a very good full-time income. It could be just two or 300 pounds a month. And we have lots and lots of partners in the business. And this is their ambition. This is their goal to make 200 to 300 a month. It's two and a half to three and a half thousand a year. And it makes a real difference in a family budget. Maybe grow that to 500 a month, 6,000 a year. And maybe a thousand a month through time, 12,000 a year. How much difference would that make to the average family budget? And this is just part time. For those who want more, of course, we've got the fast track bonus program. And we can build into that. Starting slowly, we can build up to this, or we can go fast track from day one. 119,000 in bonuses are available 
And you, they're just the bonuses. You're building your monthly income alongside that. So given such a great opportunity, why is it that some people succeed dramatically beyond their wildest dreams? And we know some of these. Others do very well. And still others do not succeed so well. So what is the variable? First of all, it's a business. To succeed, you have to work it like a business. So if you really want to succeed at a top level, you've got to be really focused on this. Build it like a business. Distributors sometimes fail to achieve their full potential because of lack of confidence or lack of motivation. We build confidence through training and mentoring from your sponsor and your upline team. The new distributor is an apprentice and learns from his or her sponsor while starting to build their own business. So we treat the new distributor as an apprentice. We show them what to do. We teach them to do it. And we support them as they start to do it themselves. Building confidence in the business and self-confidence. So personal development is also really, really important. What about lack of motivation? What's the problem there? Well, one of the problems is it costs only 50 pounds to take out a franchise. And that is a problem in relation to motivation. And we've often jokingly talked to um, the corporate people and said, you know, if you change this fee to 500,000, then we would all be successful because we take it really, really seriously. But it's only 50 pounds, not 50,000 pounds. So in reality, there's nothing much to lose. The need isn't great enough. No one will starve if we don't, if we're not successful at our Juice Plus uh, business. It may be seen as just a bit of extra income. And you're your own boss, which is always dangerous. No one to tell you what to do. So we often do very little. The temptation is there. No compelling reason to do it. It costs very little, the need isn't great enough, and you are your own boss. So how do we get over this? Treat it like a 50,000 pound business. We do that by recognizing the real opportunity, the real potential that's in there to change our own lives and the lives of others. We not only have an opportunity here, we have a responsibility. Jeffrey Berkeley famously says that when you know all you know about this business, you, it's no longer an opportunity, it's a responsibility to share it with other people. And of course, the same goes for the product. Develop your vision, your goal, and a plan of action to achieve it. And this is so important with new distributors coming into the business that we work with them to help them to figure out their goal, their vision and help them to put together a plan of action based on that and get them success very quickly. Just go for it. Sometimes we hear, but can I do it? Draw inspiration from others who have done it. When you look around the UK or Europe or Ireland or wherever it is, you see many people who have been very, very successful. They didn't have any particular qualifications that somebody else doesn't have. They just simply saw an opportunity, they um, drew up a plan of action, and they stuck to that until they were successful. That's all that's involved. Everybody can do this. Work on yourself more than on the business. Personal development is so, so important in this business. Our attitude will determine our success. Treat it like a business, it'll pay you like a business. Treat it like a hobby, it'll pay you like a hobby. And we couldn't repeat that often enough. Designing your future. We have an opportunity to build a future for ourselves and our families. The most important consideration in my mind is not how fast or how slowly you build it. Not how big your business is, but how solid and stable. Build a stable business on solid foundations, yielding reliable monthly income for life. That's the opportunity we've got here.
That's the real opportunity. And then when you want to retire, you can pass it on to your family or you can sell it. You've got a really worthwhile asset. Stability then is based on recurring orders from satisfied customers. And here is where the capsules come in. To my mind, they are the bedrock of this business. We've customers, I know James has and Gordon has, and I have going back almost 30 years. They're capsule customers. Successful distributors are another very important plank of a successful business. Their success is your success. A simple duplicating system and keep it simple. These are three of the most important words in this business. Keep it simple. Culture and attitude, building relationships, caring for your customers and your distributors more than you care about your own future. And the essential building blocks of a solid business are clubs, clubs or qualifying business. I'm sure everybody understands what a club is. A rock solid, profitable business is based on clubs. These are the blocks we build our business with. When you become a qualifying business, you're earning in the region of 200 pounds a month. And that's just the start. When you duplicate that then, your income will grow not only quickly, but very solidly. 700, 1200, 2000, 3000, you're up to 39 club and 100 club, you're into really, really big money. In this business, you set your own pace. Sometimes people feel that's okay for them, but I can't do that. But you set your own pace. You can fast track. A small percentage of people do. But small, consistent steps always deliver success, provided they're consistent and you keep doing it and keep doing it and keep doing it. Just draw up a plan to suit you. Work with your sponsor, with your upline, Devise a plan that suits you and uh, your lifestyle and do it consistently. It's a team business. It's about helping others to achieve their goals. As Jim Rohn said, help enough people to achieve what they want and you can have everything you want. So I want to finish by giving you a challenge. In 2022, can you help two people to get to a club or qualifying business? and teach those two to help others to do the same in the following years. So if you're up for that, this is what can happen for you. Help two people to achieve a club, teach them to help others do the same. So in 2022, you will help two people. And at the end of 2022, you will have two clubs in your business. Now, you've taught them in 2023 to do the same. So those two from 2022 will, will develop two clubs each next year. So they'll add on four clubs to your team. Those four will do the same in 2024. And that will add on another eight clubs to your team. And those eight will each bring through two clubs in 2025. So it'll add 16 to your team. And finally, 2026, each of the 16 will add two clubs to your business. The total number of clubs you have there already at the end of 2026 is 62. Now this seems short, uh, slow progress, small steps, but it is. Remember, all of the 62 clubs in your business are each making a good income. Those who've just started and became a club are earning around 200 pounds. But those who've been there a while will be earning over a thousand, maybe some of them 2,000 a month. And for you, a 62 club business earns about 7,500 a month roughly 90,000 pounds a year. And all you did was bring through two clubs this year and teach everybody to do the same with their own business in the next four years after that. So set a five-year goal. Your it'll be your vision 
2022 to 2026. We have the opportunity of a lifetime. So what would make a real difference to you and your family? Remember, if you think you can, you can. Look around you at the people who are successful. They're no better qualified than you are. Remember, your present circumstances do not determine where you can go. They merely determine where you start. And finally, Zig Ziglar had this famous quote. He said, you were born to win, but to be a winner, you must plan to win. You must prepare to win, and you must expect to win. And James, I can't speak any faster than that. Thank you for listening. Well, Damon, that was absolutely incredible. I mean, really, what a comprehensive overview of everything to do with our business, everything to do with network marketing. And I think the thing that's amazing about what you've just presented is, is that it just makes it so believable. Um, and that's the thing, isn't it? Once people have got understanding, then they can get belief. And that's the key element. And I think that's what you presented beyond all everything um, that you've given us just tremendous sense of belief. So absolutely incredible. So that's it, everyone. Um, I'm just uh, going to finish now. Um, thank you very, very much for attending. Thank you very, very much for uh, Damon and also for Gordon and for Lilik and Jeff and Charity and Sue and also for all of um, the wonderful people that came on to uh, tell stories. But also uh, thank you very much for taking up uh, your time this morning uh, to be with us. We really, really appreciate it. Uh, these mornings I find so utterly inspiring. I mean, I've taken pages and pages of notes. Um, and I hope you found something really, really valuable uh, from that. Uh, we look forward to seeing you at the conference on May the 21st in London. Um, hopefully you've got a ticket. Unfortunately, it's all sold out. But, um, you know, that that is going to be an even bigger version or far, far bigger version of what you've seen here this morning. So thank you, everyone, very, very much for coming along today. I have a wonderful day. Um, I have a wonderful weekend and we look forward to seeing you soon. And goodbye for now. Take care. Goodbye. Bye.